There are quite a few really scary places in our universe. Most of them are cold worlds where there is no chance that life will ever originate there. But even among all this gloomy diversity, it is possible to distinguish some objects that can rightfully be called the most dangerous planets ever discovered to date. Shortly before Halloween 2020 year, NASA compiled a list of the most terrifying worlds. Among other things, they included six exoplanets. The environment of each of these objects is not just extremely harsh for any living organism, even being in their relatively close proximity can lead to death. And today I invite you to get acquainted with the most incredible of them. I will welcome you to the Spaced Op channel and in this video I will tell you about the most creepy planets in space. Before you start watching, I ask you to like this video and subscribe to my channel. After all, every video is a huge work. Well, I dare not delay. I wish you a pleasant viewing. The first object in the list is a black gas giant. Under the name Ters to be, this celestial object orbits the starters too, which is a yellow dwarf located at a distance of 718 light years from us. Due to some unique properties of the chemical composition of the surface of Ters 2b, the planet absorbs more than 99% of all light falling on it. The nature of these properties remains a mystery and, most likely, some chemical reactions occur on the surface that we have never recorded on any such object before. And it is these properties that make Ters 2b the darkest exoplanet on the astronomical map of our time. This gas giant was discovered on the 21st of August, 2006, and more detailed information about its characteristics was obtained several years later. The mass of Ters 2b is 1.2 tenths of the mass of Jupiter, and its radius is one and a half times the radius of Jupiter. The temperature of the atmosphere reaches 1000 degrees Celsius, which gives the exoplanet a faint red glow, similar to embers. However, despite its gloomy appearance, Ters 2d Siva B does not really claim to be called the most dangerous place in the universe. There are many more objects hiding in space that are scarier than this. Here is another exoplanet, which is called 55 Cancri. It is located in the system of the sun-like star 55 Cancri. A. This celestial object was discovered on the 30th of August, 2004 with the help of Doppler spectroscopy. The mass of the planet is approximately 8 Earth masses, and its radius is almost 2 Earth radii. 55 Cancri is blocked by the tide, and therefore it is always daytime on one side and nighttime on the other. That is why the side that is turned to the star always heats up to a temperature reaching more than 2,400 degrees Celsius while the temperature on the night side is more than 1,300 degrees Celsius. These values are so high because the distance between the planet and its parent star is only 0.2 hundredths of an astronomical unit. This distance is about 5,000 times closer than the distance from Earth to the Sun. The period of the planet's orbit is slightly less than 18 hours. As for the composition of the atmosphere, Helium and hydrogen are recorded in it. It also contains a large amount of carbon. By the way, this element probably forms thick layers of graphite and diamonds in the bowels of the planet. 55 Cancri is not the only object in the planetary system of its host star. Four more celestial objects revolve around it. The environment on them is much more hospitable than the 55 Cancri system, however, this planet also has far from the worst conditions for life, compared to the next object. The next object is called a poltergeist, or PSR 1257 plus 12c this exoplanet, lying in the pulsar system. The celestial object is located only zero hole, 36 hundredths of an astronomical unit from the center of the system. This shows that the poltergeist would not have survived the supernova explosion that must have occurred before the pulsar formed. Consequently, the exoplanet probably formed after this grandiose event, and the material for it came from the nebula left after the explosion. According to another hypothesis, 
the Pulsar may have formed after the merger of two white dwarfs. Unlike a supernova, this process is not always accompanied by a powerful explosion. However, since this is the first object of its kind that we have discovered, science cannot give a definite answer as to its origin. The system with the celestial object is located at a distance of 2,300 light years from Earth. Its mass is about four times the mass of our planet. As for its orbital period, it is about 66 days. By the way, the extremely powerful radiation emitted by the pulsar is enough to crush any spacecraft wishing to approach the mysterious exoplanet. Even with all these properties, the poltergeist taken into account does not really qualify as the most dangerous exoplanet known to us. If an astronomical body can simply collapse when approaching it, then when approaching the next object, the cosmic body will begin to evaporate altogether. The reason for this effect is the extremely high temperature on Kepler 7eb, which is the hottest exoplanet known to us. The object orbits the substellar Kepler 70. The surface temperature is higher than on our Sun and reaches 6,800 degrees Celsius. The mass of the object is equal to half of the mass of the Earth, and its radius is zero hole. 76 hundredths of the radius of the Earth. The orbital period of a celestial object is 345 minutes. In other words, a day here lasts less than six hours. Interestingly, the exoplanet regularly passes by another object in the system, Kepler 70, at a distance of 240,000 kilometers. To date, this is the closest recorded approach of planets in space. The extremely high temperature on Kepler 70b can be explained by the fact that this object may have once been part of its parent star. As for assigning it the status of an exoplanet, more evidence will be needed to confirm that it deserves its assignment, so this question remains open. It should be noted that Kepler 70b is not the only celestial object known to us that interacts so closely with its host star. Another object in similar conditions is an exoplanet known as WASP-12b. This celestial body is located at a distance of 870 light years from our system. Its radius is twice the radius of Jupiter, and its mass is almost one and a half times the mass of Jupiter. WASP-12b is only zero hole, three hundredths of an astronomical unit from its parent star. Due to this proximity, the temperature of the exoplanet reaches 2,200 degrees Celsius. The extremely powerful gravity of the host star is slowly absorbing WASP-12b. It is expected that eventually in about 10 million years the exoplanet will be completely destroyed. Taking all this into account, we will probably never delve into the nature of this exoplanet. It would seem that the study of worlds of this kind cannot occupy the first place in the list of priorities of scientists. However, some of these objects may have some truly unique features, seemingly quite simple and mundane. Such worlds can be fraught with much more dangers than it may seem at first glance. For example, flying past the celestial body HD 189-733b, one could complacently consider it a safe planet, since it looks like our Earth. But if someone dropped as low as the level of his atmosphere, he would be exposed to some life-threatening dangers. To begin with, the winds of the object carry away silicate particles and develop a speed of 9,000 km per hour. In addition, rains on this planet cause molten glass to precipitate. The reasons for such dangerous weather conditions are extremely high temperatures and the chemical composition of the atmosphere. If we talk about the orbital period of the exoplanet, it is about two and a half days, and it is very likely that the object is tidally connected to its parent star. HD 189-733b is a bright blue gas giant orbiting an orange dwarf in the constellation Vulcan. It is only 63 light years from our system. The diameter and mass of the object slightly exceeds the mass of Jupiter. Interestingly, 
The distance between HD 189733b and its star is 30 times less than the distance between the Earth and the Sun and is approximately 5 million kilometers. Due to its close proximity to the parent star, it has a constant surface temperature reaching about 930 degrees Celsius on the day side, while the temperature on the night side never drops below 425 degrees Celsius. Interestingly, when a planet passes between an observer on Earth and its star, its atmosphere takes on a reddish hue. Perhaps this effect is caused by haze in the atmosphere. According to preliminary estimates, it consists of iron particles, silicates, and aluminum oxide. Additional studies have revealed the presence of carbon monoxide on the day side of the planet. However, most of the questions were raised by the results of studies that revealed traces of an unusual type of methane in the planet's atmosphere. It has been shown that this chemical element is in a kind of fluorescent state when it emits electromagnetic radiation in the infrared range. This state of matter indicates some unknown activity in the atmosphere of 189733b, which has not yet been clarified. This is a pretty good example of a situation where the study of an object such as an exoplanet with exceptionally harsh conditions can lead to unexpected results about some of the processes taking place there, which will become a valuable contribution to science. I think after learning about such planets, humanity should appreciate our Earth, because our living conditions are just perfect compared to the planets listed above. This video has come to an end. I hope you liked it. See you in the new videos. Bye to everyone.